know, guys, uh, this is uh, uh, still, we're still in chapter two. So we're going to start, uh, you know, uh, with lesson 2.3. We're going to go to uh, solving multiple equations. Uh, before that, just to have, give you an idea, I'd like to show you what we did before that, which is 2.2. Uh, 2.2 was about uh, the solving of equations. It's all are going to be related, by the way. So you're going to see the same thing, solving equations with variables on both sides. So now uh, this section is going to continue what we did in 2.2. So let's go ahead and show you what's going to happen here. So solving equations with the multiple uh, steps. Now, multiple steps means what? You have, you have uh, this is an equation, for example, solving an equation. So you can see there's more than one step. So now we're going to distribute, for example, the two. And then we're going to put all the x's on one side and the numbers on one side. And then you solve for x, which is not, it's, it's almost similar to what we did before, by the way. Okay. So it's nothing, nothing new for it, uh, for us. Now, uh, the next section should be what? All right. Let's go ahead and show you the next section. So this one will be about uh, equations with no solutions or infinite many solutions now infinitely many solutions or no solutions so like sometimes some equations they have no solutions right some of them they have so many different you know uh, different multi the what they call like infinite number of solutions which is in this case i'll show you uh, how it could be an example of that for example, if you have an, a, final, a final answer that you have both sides are equal, so those are that's when you, the equation has infinitely many solutions. What does it mean, for example? Let, just I'll show you what does it mean. This thing means, you know, if you plug in any number here for the x and any number uh, for the x on this side, you'll see them, they're going to have the same answer all the whole time. So that means any, any value for x will give you, you know, uh, an answer that it's similar to the, both sides. So that's why it's infinitely. Uh, now, uh, so a one solution answer, usually that's normal. Okay. Uh, no solution. I'll, I'll see. Uh, okay, we're going to see. Uh, that's when you have on different numbers on both sides, that which is not acceptable. You cannot have a, a 1 equals to, uh, to a, a 5, for example. If you have 1 equal to a 5, that means no solution. So that means whatever you, you, you put a value for x, you're not going to get any solution at the end. Um, now, this is the, what we do uh, usually after at, at the end of each section. We have a lot of exercises that we're going to be doing. We in this this sections we is going to be a lot of writing, a lot of uh, working working uh, out uh, some problems uh, on, on your notebooks, and, uh, and that's it. So uh, we'll try to see if we could go further than that. We'll do we'll we'll do this. Okay, guys. Bye bye.